Hello and welcome to another update video about ADA. Yeah, on the ADA chart, um, we haven't seen much movement since yesterday. Um, we have two wave counts that we're tracking here, obviously, um, at least two potential bullish ones. Doesn't mean the market has to follow it, it's pretty unreliable. Um, why is it unreliable? I don't trust it. I said it yesterday. This shallow pullback, yeah, it could be a wave two, you know, like a move up in wave one, a pullback in wave two, extremely shallow. Yeah, I mean, it's possible, but you just can't trust it. Um, so in a more directly bullish scenario, we see this here as a one, two. And then yesterday I had it labeled as another one, two setup, but this looks more like a three wave move where we have a small ABC structure in between. So it would be an A wave of um, a third wave. Okay, so orange just shows the possibility of a corrective structure in wave three because it is possible that all of this is just a diagonal pattern. So I don't necessarily trust it. I think this counts best now as well in light of the recent events here and the shallow pullback and everything just as an ABC structure in wave one as well. Possible, right? And then the C wave is like an ending diagonal. So it's all it's all a big mess. So we can label that as one, two, okay? And then A, B, C in wave three, which means the support area is unchanged from yesterday, however, for this possible um, B wave pullback in wave three. The support region for a B wave is typically between the 78.6 retracement and the 38.2 retracement for a possible B wave pullback. And it would be an A, B, C structure labeled like that a wave this could be a b wave top and maybe a c wave down is gonna follow um which could drive us deeper into the upper support region but that would be yeah that would be a diagonal pattern and then we would like to see a reaction before the price breaks and sustains below 32.4 cents and if we then see a break above the b wave top at around 35.2 cents here this swing high that formed yesterday this would be a first indication that wave C to the upside is, is following. And the C wave would be a five wave pattern as it always is. A C wave is a five wave move. So what we'd like to see is a wave one to the upside, a wave two to the downside, a three to the upside, a four to the downside and a wave five. So once we have the first one, two setup in wave C, that could be a confirmation that wave C has really started. Break above the B wave top, yep already a good indication, but we need that one, two setup. That could be the next setup then. But first let's see if we can hold 32.4 cents. Now, what if we don't hold 32.4 cents and we're breaking down? Well, it would then em emphasize the idea of a larger wave two correction. So there could be a larger ABC, which would again, turn into a larger ABC or something. Either way, you know, as, as soon as we break below 32.4 cents, it would be potentially more bearish, but still keeps the door open for higher prices in the yellow scenario in which this was a larger wave one and this here is a larger wave two pullback it's looking not too bad at the moment in you know in the sense that yep we had a rally and so far we're not breaking down it's still consolidating at a pretty high level still doesn't look finished in terms of its correction so might get at least one more leg down so expect further corrections i posted that earlier today on discord I think my wording was around like, you know, it doesn't look finished and we have to expect further corrective price action before an upside breakout. But again, there's no guaranteed breakout, but at the moment it looks like the correction isn't finished yet because also the rally from the Friday low was corrective. So it typically indicates a little bit more downside might follow and the levels are there, you know, below 29 cents. However, we have to expect that also the Monday low is breaking and the bullish um, structures we're tracking here will then likely be invalidated. So that's the update about ADA. Hope you liked the update. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe. And if you really like the content, then please check out the channel membership. Also make sure that you follow us on Instagram and Twitter for additional content. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye-bye.